All right, so I know I, I, I lied, people. Um, I just made a video a few hours ago that said, hey, I won't be doing any more videos this week. But uh, I got some time now, so I figured, you know, might as well, uh, you know, break my promise here. I mean, it's worth it. You know, you know, my video, I put videos in my video calendar. I mean, they're not set in stone permanently, but 90% of the time, to 90, probably like 95% of the time, I mean, it's accurate, at, you know, at least 95% of the time. I mean, sometimes plans will change, and I will try my best to, uh, you know, put videos on there accordingly to where it won't be changed. But you know, sometimes shit pops up, and you know, it, you know, I, I, it just doesn't, you know, fit in with my schedule, and I can't make videos or whatever. So you, you know, I, I like the video calendar. It helps me keep track of when I'm making videos, and I hope you know some people might look at it. I don't know if they do or not, but uh, yeah. But I, I figured, you know, got some time. You know, Cena just won the belt last or yesterday. You know, so might as well do a rant on John Cena right now. And it's always fun to rant. So I, I just couldn't wait a week, guys. So you know, I put it on my video calendars next Monday, but I couldn't wait a week to rant because you know I love to rant. Um, so yeah, I, I, let's get started here on this rant. Somebody asked me to do a rant on John Cena. It was a requested video. I mean. I probably wasn't going to make this video because I just rant on him so much. You know, a rant's not really necessary, but I guess, you know, I might as well just condense it all together in one video here. You know, John Cena, he's like a 15-time fucking champion. You know, he wins everything. He very rarely loses clean. I'm, I mean, the whole John Cena character is just retarded. He comes out there looking like a goofball with his fucking, you know t-shirts and this this the salute is just horrible like he just doesn't act like a tough guy I mean all you know I feel like you know especially if you're in a top spot in WWE you should have some you know you should be at least you know have a little bit of badass in, in you I mean you don't have to be like a stone cold badass but you should be like I mean like Daniel Bryan's not like a stone cold Steve Austin badass but I mean he's still not a pussy like John Cena is I mean he's far from being a fucking goofball I mean people are like oh he's chance yes I mean you know that, that means he's stupid you know I like the yes thing you know it's catchy it's yes yeah I, I don't know about it. it's just something you know but like you can't see me I mean that's like something a nine-year-old would do but I mean there's just something about fucking going like that and chanting yes that's just catchy and it's fun to do. And I got the fucking t-shirt on right fucking now, people. But like, you can't see me. I'm, I'm, it's like, I don't like it. It just seems too retarded for me. It's like, it doesn't even make sense. When he says, you can't see me, it's like, you're right. I can see you. I mean, it doesn't even make fucking sense. You know, and it's, it's just like, oh, never give up. You know, and, and also like his catchphrases, I mean, if he was better, like, a, you know, more entertaining, I mean, they might be better. Like, Daniel Bryan's gr a great fucking talent, so maybe his catchphrases seem better to me. But I think, like, you know, he's, it's, it's just, John Cena is so much of a PG retard. Like, his catchphrases might seem worse than if Daniel Bryan used them. But, you know, it's, I don't know, I just, I just hate everything about John Cena pretty much. I mean, like, his catchphrases, like, never give up. I mean... That's like fucking as generic baby face as you could get right there. What else does he see? Uh, hustle, loyalty, respect. <laughs> you know, like it sounds like a fucking goofball almost. You know, like it's just like your generic baby face. You know, and like it's a, just like a, a cartoon almost. Like a it's like a show made for nine year olds. Like that's your typical character that a nine year old would want to see. You know, it's and it's, it's frustrating too. See him come down there to the ring, you know, and I hate when the announcers are like, you know, oh, he gets the biggest reactions in WWE, you know, when like, that's their excuse now, you know, to, to fucking, when they boo John Cena, they're like, everybody's like, boo, and the announcers are like, and uh, he gets the biggest reactions, he, he you know, uh, forces the most emotions out of the WWE universe, nobody else can do, yeah, they're all fucking booing. I mean, come on! Like, it's just so. Re I mean, they're, it's true though. I mean, he does, you know, uh, exalt like the biggest like reaction, but they're all fucking boos, or at least a lot of them are. 
Ugh, it's it's just frustrating, you know, the whole, they try to act like he's the greatest. They call him like, oh, the greatest of all time, John Cena, the greatest of all time, the greatest champion of all time, or one of the greatest, you know, he's, you know, and they're like, oh, you could, you, you know, you could hate him, but you got to respect the fact that he's a legend, you know, uh, it's just, everything about him makes me, I'm getting worked up now, just talking about, it. like, everything about him I fucking hate, you know. Like they call him like great, and I'm like, he's not great. He can wrestle a little bit. He can wrestle decent. He can, you know, he can actually wrestle a great match. But I mean, he, a lot of his wrestling ability is like weak. Like he, a lot of his moves look fake as fuck. Like the five knuckle shuffle. Like every time you could tell he doesn't even hit his guy, the guy. You know, and the fucking his punches look fake as fuck too. A lot of the times he's like, you know, I, I, I'm not even gonna imitate it. You know, I can't even. You know, and. Like, five moves of doom, of course. I mean, it's the same old shit to finish the match every time, it seems like. You know, fucking, uh, the fucking, I don't even know, the sideways slam or whatever. You know, the, the shoulder tackles, five knuckle shuffle, shuffle attitude adjustment. Ugh, just makes me so mad. And in the, in, in the meanwhile, while he's doing that, the announcers are pretty much like jacking off to him. You know, while he's doing all that shit. And you know, and then his promos are horrible. He talks again like a fucking nine-year-old. He acts like a fucking child in there. And then, you know, and he's like, oh, I love my character. You always see him in interviews. Like, I love what I do. You know, you love acting like a fucking child. He must act like, you know, I don't even fucking know why Nikki Bella fucking likes him. Like, if he acts like a child, and does he act like a child? I, I don't fucking know. He seems like, like, I don't know. You know, it's, it's hard to tell with John Cena. You know, like, he actually likes it. You know, maybe he'll come out, like, ten years later when he fi finally fucking retires and says, I, you know, I hated my damn character in WWE. It was a bunch of bullshit. The only reason I played it like that is because I made money and I, and I made kids happy. I hope he does that in, like, ten years. You know, that would make me so happy, too, you know, to see him do that. Um, but, yeah, his promos are shitty as fuck. They're bad jokes. He can't cut a fuck. He can't be funny because he... He, he appeals to nine-year-olds, so he does nine-year-old comedy jokes. So, you know, every time you watch him, you're like, yeah, hey, yeah, hey, you know, it's not even fucking funny, you know, that's what I, you know, like, every once in a while, he'll give me a little chuckle, but not even close to, like, what some of the other guys can, you know, make me laugh more. Like, Bo Dallas makes me laugh ten times more than John Cena, you know, um, and, like, like, all the legends, too, like, Whenever they put a legend on WWE TV, half the time the legend's like sucking John Cena's dick and like telling him how great he is, like Ric Flair, you know, whenever he's on it seems like he's fo fo like fo like he's affiliated with John Cena and sucking his dick, you know, and all these other legends are like, like bowing down to Cena pretty much, you know, saying he's the greatest of all time, Hulk Hogan glorifying Cena, saying how great he is, you know, and it's just so so frustrating you know when you got talent like Daniel Bryan, Cesaro, Bray Wyatt and other guys you know there's many other guys who deserve this to be in the spot Cena's in uh but they're not I don't know you know like like I don't know what goes down with Vince McMahon's head like if he took John Cena out of the main event spot and put a guy like Ziggler, Cesaro, Bray Wyatt in it he would make a lot more money in the long run but he doesn't want to do that you know I don't know like the ratings are low, they've dropped a half since the Attitude Era. They're fucking in the fucking shitter. Yet he keeps doing the same old shit. You know, they always say, oh, he just wants to make money. It's all about money. But it seems like he doesn't want to make money. Like, whenever we like somebody, like Bray Wyatt. You know, everybody likes Bray Wyatt, you know. He's a good wrestler. He cuts fucking awesome promos. You know, he wrestles great matches. You know, just puts on classic matches like with Daniel Bryan and even John Cena. He put on some good matches with him, you know, so he's, and, and you know, the Wyatt family versus the Shield, what a feud that was, you know, just a great talent, or, you know, probably one of the best in the company right now, one of my favorites, probably my top five, and a lot of people love him, you know, they, they fucking hold up the cell phone, and I even do it at home, I don't, sometimes I'll even turn off the light and put, put it up like a fucking retard at home, I feel like I'm fucking awesome, that I'm, a, I actually look like a fucking retard. You know, and I even sing when they sing the fucking song. You know, just like I say we the people when they say we the people. And I, I feel like a fucking retard, but I don't give a shit. Um, so yeah, everybody likes him, you know. 
And then you, you knew, I knew it, I knew it. I knew he would lose to Cena at WrestleMania. I predicted it. I'm like, there's no way they're going to put him over. John Cena, the, the Superman, the poster boy. You know, the greatest of all time. You know, John Cena. You know, I knew they would never do it. And they didn't, you know. Ugh. Pisses me the fuck off. Like, like we all like him, you know. Like, like seriously, if I wanted to be a WWE superstar and get on top, I would just do fucking rust holes and boring bullshit all the time. Because if you're talented, you don't get shit in WWE. Ugh. Like, if you're talented, like Dolph Ziggler has talent. He doesn't get anything. Cesaro has talent. He doesn't get anything. Bray Wyatt has talent. He gets a little bit, but he loses. He just lost to fucking Jericho. So if I was a fucking wrestler in this company, I would fucking wrestle shitty matches because shitty matches are what, what, what gets you on top. Like, Orton's been in the fucking main event now pretty much consistently for the past fucking year ever since he won at Money in the Bank. So it's been over a year now. I mean, he was off the radar for a little bit, but he was just in the main event last fucking paper. And he can't fucking wrestle a match. All he did is fucking rest holds. The whole fucking match, he botches a lot too. And everybody just, you know, says he's awesome. You know, not as many people as there used to be, which I'm happy about, but still. And then you got fucking Kane in the main event, who's like a thousand years old. I mean, he's probably going to have a heart attack in a few days. Or like a few years, whatever. You know, because he's all fucking old. Ugh, like all these guys in the main event are so fucking old. I mean, they're going to have strokes soon. Why don't they just stop fucking wrestling, you know? Like, they've wrestled for like 20,000 fucking years. Can that, Can they stop and give the fucking younger guys a chance to fucking wrestle I mean I see Big Show like oh when I'm you know when I'm uh, fucking you know can't wrestle anymore uh, I'm gonna stop you well you can't fucking wrestle anymore you do fucking boring ass moves the whole time you 500 pound big fat ass I mean I hate to call him a fat ass but he is can't fucking wrestle and uh, just going off now you know, just you know, when I start ranting on something, and you know, I always get to another topic, and I, I just get off top. What, whatever. Point is, John Cena does not deserve to be in the main event. He sucks. And um, there's different people like Bray Wyatt, Cesaro, Ziggler, Brian, etc. You know, you know who I like if you watch my videos. Who should be in the main event? So um, there you go, people. <laughs> there's my fucking rant. Got a little bit worked up there. I think I, I think I might even be sweating, but. Uh, pretty hot in my room. I think it's like 80 degrees in my room, but yeah. You know, those my thoughts on fucking, you know, or, or a rant on John's fucking Superman Cena. So there you go, people.